Hi, this is Larry Jordan. Let's answer another Final Cut Studio question. Next one's from Robert. Uh, looks like Ginger. Uh, what is the command to select all clips? Oh, oh, I like this one too. I'm going to make this smaller so we can see what's going on. If you put your playhead between two windows and drag up and down, you can make windows bigger or smaller. I want to give myself some room to work. I hold the Option key down. Option up arrow raises a clip or lowers a clip. Option up and down arrow allows me to move a clip between tracks. Let's say that I want to select all clips on all tracks starting at the position of the playhead. Well, the tool that you need is this one in the tool palette. It's the third one down. These are called track selection tools. The single arrow to the right selects every clip to the right of where you click on a single track. This one selects every clip on a single track to the left of where you click. This selects every clip on a single track in both directions. This selects every clip on all tracks to the right and every clip on all tracks to the left. And if you're sitting down, this is the keyboard shortcut T, 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 and T, 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 T. Ah, it took me months to memorize that. Anyway, select the multi-track tool and click. And notice that all clips to the right of where you clicked are selected. But wait a minute. Why did the audio get selected? Well, the audio extends to the right of where I clicked, and Final Cut only selects entire clips, so the audio got selected. But then why did this first clip get selected? And the answer is because the first clip is linked to, the audio and the video are linked to, the audio. So if we just disconnect that link, then it would only select just the clips that we click on. Well, here's a cool, cool secret that's known to only a few of the cognoscenti. I'm sure there's cognoscenti around. I haven't met any, but I'm sh watch this. If I type the letter T, that selects the single tool. If I click, it only selects the clips on a single track to the right of where I click. But if I hold the shift key down, it automatically changes to the select everything to the right. So the shift key takes the track selection tool, the single letter keyboard shortcut is the letter T, and selects everything on all tracks. So T by itself, single track. Shift T, everything to the right. And if you have linked clips or clips that extend under where you click, they will be selected as well. My name is Larry Jordan, and thanks for watching.